guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have for you my top five favorite nude lipsticks. I love lipsticks. I think I have quite of an obsession with them. I can go into Sephora wanting to buy a mascara, a blush, and maybe a powder, and I will come out with eight lipsticks and none of the other products. Yeah, I know, it's pretty bad. Starting off with a lipstick by MAC, and this is Velvet Teddy, which was, I'm pretty sure, one of my first lipsticks I've ever purchased from MAC, and I completely fell in love with it. This is, I believe, my fourth tube of this, and I'm almost running out. But this is just a absolutely pretty, pretty brownish nude. I love wearing this during fall and winter. I think this is a really pretty fall shade. And it is a matte finish and it's just super, super pretty. This is so pigmented as well. Just one layer of this and you're good to go. Absolutely love this and it's my go-to MAC lipstick. Another lipstick that I absolutely love is this one right here by Lancome and it's in this pencil kind of form. I absolutely love this. I did not think that I would love this as much as I do. I actually went on Lancome to buy something completely different, but if you purchased a second item, you got like 10% off or something. So of course I got a lipstick and this is the one I picked up. I've never tried any of their lipsticks and I love it. It is absolutely amazing. So like I said, it comes in this sort of stick form and I cannot tell you guys how easy this is to apply and I think it's because of the shape it's just really slim and kind of pointed so it's really easy to get in those corners of your mouth and you don't need a lip liner with this at all I absolutely love this and this is definitely a matte finish but it is so creamy it almost feels like it's moisturizing your lips super comfortable on your lips and I would definitely say this is a peachy nude and it isn't full coverage, but it's definitely buildable. It's absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, I totally love this. And I throw it in almost every bag because it's just super easy to apply this. You almost don't need a mirror or a lip liner. So love this. Of course, I could not do a top five favorite nude lipsticks without mentioning a Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. Like I said before, her lipsticks are absolutely amazing. So this is Nude Kate. And I love all of her nudish lipsticks, but why I picked this as my favorite one is because it's just the easiest to wear, I think. It's just a classic nude. It's a cream sheen, so it's super comfortable to wear. It's not too pigmented, but it's not too sheer either. It's absolutely pretty and just super comfortable to wear. So yeah, this is a definite favor and a great lipstick. And another favorite is this lipstick by Tom Ford. It is Blush Nude number 13. Oh, this is so beautiful. And if you've ever tried out Tom Ford lipsticks, then you are probably in love with them. The quality is absolutely amazing. They're so creamy. They're so comfortable on the lips. And this is just a perfect nude so i would definitely say this is a peachy nude it's it's like a creamy finish it feels really comfortable on the lips and yeah this is just gorgeous it comes off a little pink on camera i see but it's definitely more of a peachy nude really gorgeous lipstick and oh, it smells so good i like can't get over how good tom ford lipsticks smell Oh, it smells so good. And last but not least, I have a Burberry lipstick. And can we just take a moment to appreciate this packaging? I just think this packaging is so beautiful, just so classy and chic. But um, yeah, this is the lipstick. Oh, and it's also like magnetic, which I really like. Okay, I'm done playing around with it. But <laughs> this is what the lipstick looks like. And it's just like a brownish nude. This is really sheer. You can barely see this on. It gives you like a sheen, glossy kind of look, but you can definitely build this up. Sometimes I put like two or three layers on and then it definitely gives me a little more coverage, but it's definitely pretty sheer. So if you're wanting to go for something more pigmented, then you probably won't like this. 
But other than that, it's just really gorgeous. So, so yeah, those were my top five favorite nude lipsticks. And I just quickly wanted to mention that my perfect nude may be way too light or way too dark on someone else. So just keep that in mind. I think nude lipsticks just look so different on every skin tone. These are just the ones that work for me and that I love and I just wanted to share them with you guys. All right guys, so that was it for this video. I know this was a pretty quick one, but I hope you still enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching. Also, I just quickly wanted to mention that I still have a designer shoe haul going up next Sunday. I'm still waiting for one pair of shoes that I really wanted to include in that haul and show you guys. So that haul will be up next Sunday. Don't want to miss that. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. And yeah, I hope I see you guys next week. Bye.